What is going on everybody? My name is Blake and welcome back to To The Moon. Let's go see what this lighthouse is all about. Now, am I just supposed to know where this is? The kids don't have any input? I'm assuming that it's this way, but I don't have any idea. Why would I? Ah, yes, there it is. There it is! There it is! <laughs> we need to head south of... We need to head south to the street and take the other path to get down to it, though. Ah. Yeah, I forgot my parachute. <laughs> Stupid little brat. I'm <laughs> just kidding. South to the street. Okay. So... Over here, how? I don't, I have no idea how to get there. It's definitely not that way. I think they mean like the street, the street, like all the way back. It's here! Uh, my novelty beach ball. I thought I lost it. Oh, it's stupid anyway. Oh, I'll never lose it again. I'm gonna hide it. Don't look. Uh, we don't have time for this. Okay, done. Where did he hide it? Right. Now let's just head to the lighthouse. I don't know where he hid it. Probably behind the tree. Whatever. Oh, it's smoking. Who's the dummy that crashed the car? <laughs> that was, uh, Dr. Rosalind. Yeah. Oh, Dr. Rosalind. Tisk, tisk, tisk. Yeah, what an idiot she is. I... I don't know what she was thinking. Ooh, a squirrel. Indeed there is. Don't worry, kids, I got this. What? Are we having like an RPG battle with a squirrel? What? What? <laughs> Tsunami kick, tornado punch, shoe, other shoe. Tsunami kick, yelling volume? <laughs> what? The loudest. This ends here. Hiya! Stop it, or we're gonna tell Ma you animal abuse. <laughs> yeah, she called the cops on you. Oh, come on, I wasn't actually gonna. Don't you like role playing? <laughs> the squirrel runs away. That was awesome. You should be ashamed of yourself. I did think that was odd, but I was gonna roll with it. Let's name it Teddy. Okay. Let's just go. My whole night is ruined. What? Do you have something to say to me, little bird? Hmm? Okay, moving on. That was very interesting. Well, apparently this game doesn't take itself too seriously. How do I go? The moon. What is this? In memory of River E. Wiles. River Wiles, huh? Was she John's wife? Dunno. Come on, the lighthouse is right here. Alright. Ah. Up we go. Yep. This is definitely the same. This is it. A multicolored paper rabbit. 
Hey, this wasn't here when we came last week. Oh yeah, Johnny must have came here before he fell ill again. Two colors, huh? Am I the only one who's a little creeped out by these, though? Yeah, you are. Yep. What the? Someone's calling me. Ack! I should have guessed. Yeah, yeah, we're coming. Blah, blah, blah. Alright, let's head back. As for this... Received paper rabbit. What was up there at the top? And we're magically teleported back. What the cactus were you doing? Burning ants with a magnifying glass? Using moonlight? Okay, I was taking a nap then. God, it's so hard to be a smartass nowadays. You're pretty good at being half of it. Your helmet's on the couch. Get it on. We're going in. <laughs> okay, I have to stop and ask. Um, did uh, the old man turn into some kind of creature? Is that what I, I mean, it looks like an alien with a big smiley face. Am I looking at this wrong? It looks like an alien with a big, huge smile. And a... a what the fuck? Anyway, where's my helmet? Is this my helmet? Where's my helmet? Your helmet's on the couch. Chop, chop. Ah, I see. Of course, my helmet. Initiate. Ready or not, here it goes. Oh, he's wearing a helmet. Okay, that that makes a little more sense than the fact that he may have somehow transmogrified into a green alien when we left. Just a little bit, though. This should be the last accessible memory. Disable speech for all except Johnny. Done. Let's get him. At any time, you can view your position and time by moving the mouse toward the top of the screen. Ah, uh, yes. So this is Johnny as an old man. Okay. But why, I must ask? These paintings are blank. That's strange. And what is our purpose? For traveling back in time. Can we... Okay, this isn't a place I can go? I don't know where to go. What do you want from me? What am I, what am I doing? Received. Note clock. Okay. Notes. Clock. The clock, the clocks in Johnny's house never tick. Okay. Why? Why would that be a thing? It's obviously the piano, which we've seen. Okay. Ah, by Johnny Wiles. I think Johnny wrote that song. Interesting. That is nice to know. But what is my objective? I can't go that way. Where do you want me to go? I guess out here? What are we doing? What are we doing? Where am I? What is my objective? I don't know. I don't know what you want me to do. I guess just wander around. Johnny? What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. My name is Dr. Eva Rosalyn, and this is... Dr. Von Matterhorn. Dr. Lorenzo Von Matterhorn. Dr. Neil Watts. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? 
Oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Lily? Actually, you've already called us. <laughs> We're here to fulfill our contract from the relative future. Careful there. If you slip off the cliff, we're going to have to reload this memory. Watch it, Neil. Show some respect. Eh, it's just a program, you know. I know, but this is his last accessible memory, and we need its cooperation. Worst comes to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you waste time like that? You... You are here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Yes, John. I suppose I had a good run. Not good enough, it seems. So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? We can't. But you might be able to. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. It's fine. You can tell us. It's essential for helping us to get you to go there. Do you want the fame, the money? You've got to have a motive. I'm sorry. But I really don't know. I just... do. I can already tell that this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Nevertheless, Johnny, here's what we will do. We need to get to your childhood, but it is too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to traverse through your memories with gradual backward leaps. Which you've given us the permission to do in the relative future. Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for direct access, we will return here. That's when you'll need to help us influence the childhood... Help us influence the childhood you to become an astronaut. Or to get on a giant catapult. The point is, you'll need to have more to say than just, I don't know. As long as you can take me to the moon, I'll cooperate in any way possible. Good. Now, in order to leap to a memory, we need an item that is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? That'll do. Well, shall we? Ladies first. Received note, Moon. We'll need to prepare this memento first. Holy shit. Running it through the computer. Complete the memento. Click the orbs to flip pieces. What? Ah. Ah, yes. Ah. Complete the memento. The memento can now be activated for a traversal. Cool. So I can go there. Which one is it, though? Is it this one? What? 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 Activate memento? Sure. Wait a second. What about my privacy? We'll try not to violate what we can avoid. But in most cases, it can't be helped. Holy shit, look at all these. 
My god, there's origami bunnies everywhere. So, wait a second, we've barely moved? Yeah, we haven't moved much at all. Turn off visibility and interactivity. It'd be a mess, it'd be messy to be seen. Yeah, yeah, happy. Jeez, I forgot to ask him about all these rabbits. This is creeping me out. We probably should have checked his record for for psychopathy first. Psych psychopathy? Psychopathy. It has to be psychopathy. What the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. It's probably just a part of this memory. Then I stand by my point. Anyway, quit blabbering and find a memento here to hop from. Interact with objects to establish five memory links. Ah, yes. A multicolored paper rabbit. Well, aren't you special, having two colors when all your siblings look like they drowned in bleach. What's that, you think you're really creepy? Why, yes, I agree. Got one. Is this something we can take? Uh, I don't think we can get up there. Is this something? No. I need objects of your memory. Give me objects of your memory. Where can we find them? Honestly, I have no idea. Doesn't seem like I'm allowed to go very many places. Can't interact with him. Guess we'll have to go upstairs. Ah, the clock works. The clock is moving, but soundless. So it does tick now. Oh, now he's up here. Hello. Don't mind us. The Emperor's New Clothes by Hans Christian Andersen. Bam! A selection of readings from medical journals. Oh, what, those don't count? I don't understand how to figure out what items count and what don't. This room is blocked off. This part just ends. These memories are very sketchy, you see. Well, we're still missing a couple items. So I think we're going to need to go back downstairs. As I don't see any. Ah, another clock. We can use these. No. No, that doesn't count. God damn it. Down here? Hmm. That really looks like it would be something, but it's not. There's nothing I can do about it. It's a lamp, windows, none of these bunnies. I don't think I can... Can I go downstairs? No, I can't. I guess I'll have to go outside. I can't go outside? What am I missing? The fuck am I missing? The, oh, the... What? Oh, I'm shooting the memory links into the... Is it, it looked like it's an umbrella. <laughs> what? What am I doing? Why? Why do I shoot them into an umbrella? So there's two more that I need, but I can't go anywhere. Is this supposed to be difficult? Alright, one second. I'll be back when I find something. Really? What? Wait, what the fuck just happened? Okay, I clicked on him and everything changed. An old and patched up backpack. What is this, a million years old? I guess we'll find out. So that, that's still nothing? What the actual fuck? Glass bottle of pickled olives. Peh, I hate this stuff. What's to hate? It's pickled olive. Exactly. That counts. Can I talk to him again to get him to... Don't. If we have to explain our presence to him at every memory, 
I'd go crazy. Don't tempt me. Fresh wild flowers. Ah, okay. Now I have all five of them. See, that's just inconsistent, because it tells me not to... We don't want to be noticed by him. But then in order to get the last two objects, I have to talk to him. Then it tells me not to talk to him. It's like, what? I'm like stuck in limbo. There we go. Let's shoot our memory balls into the umbrella. Because that's what we do. Hadouken! What the fuck was that? What? That's it. I'm doing the breaking from now on. Memento? Prepare. You can now travel with the Memento umbrella. Reminder, the corner orb can flip the entire diagonal. Ah, I see. Is that going to be useful? It is. Oh no, it's like a lights out game or something? Oh no. How awful. Oh no. Oh no, why would it tell me that? Alright, just a second. Okay, that was much easier without doing diagonals, so I don't know why it told me to do that. Activate Memento? Yes. Let us move on through the memories. Getting a little bit further back, but not by much. We're going very slowly. When it comes to rain, through is better than on to. I don't mind it regardless. Seems like these memory hops only span a short period of time. We need to find a leaping memento, or it's going to take forever. Meh, just enjoy the scenery. Are we supposed to talk to him? An old stuffed toy platypus. Honestly, I just don't think this animal has the right to exist. The world's not big enough for the two of you. So we, we're not supposed to. T we're not talking to him anymore. Looks like we are not. We are not speaking with him. Requires three bars of memory links to proceed. Uh, well, fuck you. Okay. Ah, and I got him. Okay, and we're not supposed to talk to him. Okay. Let's go into the lighthouse. It's finished. River. Like you, I'll be able to watch over her every day. She won't be alone anymore. Oh, is her name River? I might never understand why, but I stayed true to your wish. I'm sure Anya is grateful to you too. But when I'm gone... Who is going to watch over us? Who are you? My name is Eva. I was just passing by. Was she your wife? Yes. Her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. Hmm? She... She didn't need to do it. But she... You wouldn't understand. I don't even understand.
Received note, Anya. Alright. Up the lighthouse we go. Well, that's fucking sad. <laughs> Don't really know what else to say, it's just fucking sad. And that's supposed to be what this game is. Very emotional, from what I've read, and it's at very positive reviews. About time you got here, I almost thought you fell off the cliff. What were you doing? Enjoying the scenery, what else? Any luck here? Big luck. Huge. Dinosauric. Huh. This place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse. What do you expect? Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun re-breaking the barrier for yourself. Another platypus. Memento detected. Oh. Oh. I have no more orbs to shoot into it. A broken lighthouse lamp. Hi. Why does that happen? I need one more memory. Can I talk to you? Ah, he was the final one. Nice. Fire that memory ball. Alright. Are we just going to leave Dr. Watts? Whatever, let's prepare it. Get the memento prepared by playing a strange game of lights out. Ideal shows the minimum number of moves the memento can be completed in. Three? One second. Oh, that was so easy. I thought it was gonna t thought it was gonna take longer than that. Okay, we're ready. Activate memento. Activate. I assume that Dr. Watts is going to meet us there. At least that would make sense. Ah, we're back when he's a little younger now. Just enough. After we pay for your operation, we'll have just enough left for it, so you don't worry. White lie. That's what you call it, right? No, I'm sure we can just stop it. I don't like it when you lie. I calculated our finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try to convince me against my will? We need the money for your medical bills, River. I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this... This is just too much. I mean, she... She isn't even... Do you know what makes me happy, Johnny? What? Do you? Well, I do. I just hope you can help me with it. River. When the papers for my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you would grant my wish, I want you to use it to finish building that house. And then... For every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. Visit her, speak to her, comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. And what about you? Happy. I'll be happy. Johnny? Yes. I made this. Tell me what it is. What? Just tell me what it is. It's a rabbit, like all the others you made. 
What else? Um, it's made of paper. What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? Look, River. I wrote a song. It's for you. Okay. Well, would you like to hear it? Yes. You didn't have to bring the piano in here for this. I can hear you just fine with the door open. It's called Four River. Why so cliche? It's just a placeholder. the song the kids were playing. Who is this Anya they were talking about? If she's so important, shouldn't we have seen her in his late memories? I guess he didn't keep that promise after all. Unless... Unless what? Never mind. Hey, that's the same song the kids were playing earlier, huh? I guess he taught them. You know what? I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on. I already got my memory links. You want to hitch a quick ride or look around yourself? Um... I'll probably just travel with him. Let's just go. We saw the most relevant part of the story. There's no need to go around collecting objects and shooting them into umbrellas. So a little bit further back, but not by much. It sucks because when I play this game, I can't see how long I've been recording. Because the resolution and the way it steals the... Whatever, I just can't. So I think I'm going to end this episode here. I don't know how long it's been. I think it's been a while. So thank you so much for watching. The story is getting much better. It's definitely getting better. I'm starting to get involved in it, but it still has a lot of developing to do. Obviously, we have no idea who Anya is, and we have no clue why he wants to go to the moon. And we haven't really gotten that far back in time yet, but I hope you're enjoying this as much as I am. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.